Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. And if you're new, welcome to my channel. So today I'm gonna do a little bit something different. I am going to be doing a perfume review. So I'm going to be naming my top complimented high-end and drugstore perfume. So that's perfume and that's body mist spray. So body sprays as well. Um, if this is your type of content, feel free, sit back, relax, and we'll go ahead and get started. All right, so if you see me looking over, that's because I do have notes on my perfumes because of course each perfume, each body spray is different. So I did notate them so that I can give you an idea of what they smell like. Me personally, guys, I mix my drugstore perfumes with some of my high-end perfumes. So we'll talk about more of that later, but let me go ahead and get started. Okay. So the first perfume that I have is the DKNY Be Delicious perfume. This is really pretty and it's green. So of course it's in a green bottle. It smells like green apple. Um, it's mixed with sweetness and it smells like fresh fruits. When you spray this, you're going to smell like a green apple. This perfume literally smells like green apple. One of my favorites. I do use this sparingly. Um, this is kind of pricey as well, but I do use it. I really like this perfume, so I do recommend this perfume. Okay, so this is the Aqua Di Gioia Giorgio Armani perfume. It is a fresh, calming mint type of perfume. It has a touch of jasmine in there. So this is more of a daytime, summer type of perfume. This is a very long-lasting perfume as well. So yeah, I do recommend this perfume. This, this is very long-lasting. Everybody will notice you on this. This smells really, really good. All right, this is Rebel de Fleur. This is Riri's perfume. This is Rihanna's perfume. This is a sweet vanilla coconut type of perfume. This perfume, it's very sexy, sweet, and warm. I do love this perfume. I am glad I purchased this. I went through a, another size bottle of this. I had a different spray bottle of this, um, like in a jar like this, um, but I went through that already. So this is definitely a repurchase. I love this perfume. Okay, this is the Coty Lorigan Cologne Spray for Women. Uh, this is a spicy and sweet perfume. It has a citrus touch to it. It also has a warm scent with vanilla mixed in here as well. This, once you spray this on, this will last you the whole day as well. This is a very nice perfume. Okay, so this is the Victoria's Secret Tea's Heartbreaker Fragrance Mist Perfume. Um, this one is more of like a fruity, girly type vanilla scented perfume. It smells good when you apply it, but you do have to kind of like reapply it during the day because the stay, it's kind of short lasting, but it does smell good whenever you apply it. Okay, the next perfume I have is Exclamation Point. This right here, this is a fun and flirty perfume. This has a sexy and a sweet smell to it. It's definitely a grown woman fragrance and it is a long lasting perfume. So I do recommend this as well. I think I got this at Walmart, but yeah, this is a very nice fragrance as well. This is the Ariana Grande Sweet Light Candy Perfume. This one is a fruity, sweet smell. It kind of like reminds you of Skittles. It's kind of sweet. This is a perfume, it smells really good, but you may have to, you know, reapply it during the day. But yeah, it smells really good, so I like this. So we do have the Beyonce Heat Perfume. This one is a grown woman perfume as well. It's sweet, it's sexy, it's actually fruity and sweet. This perfume has mango blossom in it. It has a mix of amber and musk in it as well. So I really do like this perfume. You can smell this perfume on you. This is a long lasting perfume. I remember I sprayed it on and it was in the summertime and you can still smell it. It lingers on. So yeah, I really like this perfume. The next perfume I have is the Dulce & Gabbana Lily perfume. This bad boy right here, this smells, is so soft. So like when you put it on, it's very soft, but it's very long lasting. So like, I really like this. Of course, Dulce & Gabbana is not cheap. Um, I do have the travel size here or whatever you wanna call it, just the spray. But yeah, this, this is some very nice perfume. It's very nice, it's very luxurious. It's soft, it's sweet, it's long lasting. It is definitely worth your money. This perfume has white flower and it has jasmine in it as well. This perfume actually reminds you of something tropical, continuously being sweet. So yeah, this is a really nice perfume. I do recommend this as well. 
my favorites here, this is Valentino. I mean, this is a woman's best friend right here, Valentino. Um, it has amber in it. It smells, it has floral in it. It has a mix of jasmine, vanilla, and cashmere in it. It is definitely a grown woman perfume. It's very sexy, it's strong, it's long lasting. This perfume is more, the perfume is so luxurious, it smells like it's a rich perfume. So yeah, Valentina, I love this perfume. This is like my second bottle of it. I did have a smaller bottle of it, but I went ahead and splurged a little bit and got me a bigger bottle. I only wear these perfumes like on special occasions because I don't have it. I mean, if I wanted to, I could, but you know, I use these perfumes, you know, accordingly, just on special occasions mainly. And I mix them with my drugstore body sprays or perfumes. So we now have the Britney Spears Fantasy Perfume Spray Fragrance Mist. This perfume right here, this perfume smells like a cupcake. Whenever you put this perfume on, you are going to smell like a cupcake, literally. It's a white chocolate orchid with jasmine petals in it. So yeah, it's going to smell really good on you. So this is a sweet and sexy perfume with long lasting power. So Brittany, yeah, she did this. I, I like this, it smells really, really good. And the next three, these are, believe it or not, these are body fantasy sprays. I have the Pink Vanilla Kiss Body Fantasy Spray. I have the Cotton Candy Body Fantasy Spray and I have the Body Fantasy Lilac Spray. So these are very self-exclamatory. This smells like lilac. This smells like pink vanilla. You can smell the vanilla in this. And Cotton Candy, I love this. I love this right here. I even have one of these in my car. So I do carry one of these in my car, you know, and spray it in there along with my air fresheners. But what I do is, believe it or not, I have more perfumes in there, but these are just a few that I wanted to go over. But with these perfumes here, what I do is I will literally take like some of my body sprays, my body mist, and mix it with one perfume, like one high-end perfume. So I even take the body fantasy and I'll mix it, and I'll mix it with like Ariana Grande, or I'll mix it with Beyonce or Rihanna. I'll mix them. I'll mix them up. And then whenever I go anywhere, people are always like, you smell so good. The best thing in life is looking good and smelling good. All the time I get compliments that I smell good. Hygiene is so important. So you can, you know, have drugstore body sprays, perfumes or whatever, mix them up. Don't just put on one, put on a, you know, two or three, mix them up. You don't have to like just go to high end. You don't have to just go to drugstore, mix it up a little bit. Even if you just have drugstore, mix up all them perfumes and mix up like two or three of them. And I promise you, people gonna notice because it doesn't have to be high end. I'm just a perfume collector, so I collect perfumes and I just use them here and there, special occasions. But yeah, this is it. This is the video, guys. I just wanted to do something different. I just wanted to, you know, give you my top rated perfumes and let you know, you know, what is complimented on me. So I'm just giving you my tips and tricks to help you out. So I hope you enjoyed the video. I will have more content loading. If you have not subscribed, please feel free to subscribe. And as always, stay blessed.